Hey, all my fashionistas and fashionistas out there. It's your plus size fashionista. Mm hmm Yep. And it is going to be a review on To Die For Cosmetics. So if you guys want to cry and stay tuned, then you guys. Yeah. Watch it. Uh -huh. Got the worst on the track. Is that on the boards? Chuck. This is Lamar. Wow. Yeah, the statistics shows. Oh my gosh, she's Like I was saying in the intro before, this is going to be a review on To Die For Cosmetics. This is a cosmetics line that caters for the lips. And the owner, Miss LaVisha Tay, she is from Chicago, Illinois. I have family in Chicago, so I always go back and visit. But anyways, in the family, she has her waterproof velvet glitter lipstick. Honey, she has these glitter these velvet glitter lipsticks in various different of shades honeys get your life like what get your life and um she reached out to me and asked me did i want to do a review i said yes and y'all know i am a lippy connoisseur so of course and um i heard that um one of our own did a review on her cosmetics which is a uh, tropical thunderstorm i absolutely love love her that's her name on instagram but her name is oh my god i can't think of her name but i've been watching her for years her name used to be the xx island beauty but she changed her name i'll so have her link I'll of have her video and her review in the fashion box below as well but i was sent five different velvet glitter lipsticks i chose the yeast honeys and um we're gonna start off with the color that i am wearing right now which is called i am powerful and it is a purple honey this is really really easy um to use um oh my god like very easy i thought it was gonna be super hard but it's not she even adds um a little uh slip of how you apply these accurately and correctly um really it's really easy um all you do is you clean all oils and lipstick off your lips if you have any oils or lipstick on your lips this is optional but you don't have to but this is what i did uh to get the the pigmentation and the vibrancy that i like but you don't have to do that but i use a, a lip liner uh the same color as the color of the velvet glitter lipstick use that as a line to a uh, guide for your lips so when you put the glitter on you'll know where to stop putting it in um you want to start from the bottom and you smile while applying the lipstick base which is this right here and it has like a doe foot applicator which i can show you guys right here it has a doe foot applicator it's right here and um you put that on at the bottom you work your way up so i would suggest you use this at the bottom of your lips you smile and you apply it and then once you do that you go on the top and then you let it dry and then you want to take then you want to take your brush which is your small glitter applicator brush which is right here and then you take your velvet glitter lipstick choose which one and you take it and you use padding motions that's what i did because honey this is very messy i will tell you that anytime you use glitter is messy so i won't really say that's a con but i just want to throw that out there you want to press it in and if you see any spaces that you didn't fill you want to go back and fill them and then this is what you will have honey i will tell you get your life this is it and when you drink in any type of beverages or soda, please use a straw. And then she also tells you how to remove it. You can use a soap and water with lather and begin in a circular motion. And you will see the glitter beginning to come off. And you want to rinse and repeat. Now you can also use a lipstick, uh, a makeup remover wipe and use in a circular motion. That's what I did. Or you can use any type of oil, oil um, based remover. And um, yeah, that's it. And then she also has warning, do not eat glitter, adhesive or the lipstick, do not freeze. And if you have extra sensitive skin, do a test strip on your wrist or neck first before applying. And it says, if your skin becomes irritated, stop using the products immediately. 
And then she also said to Die For Cosmetics is not responsible for any misuse or allergic reactions to this product. All customers using this product are responsible for all occurrences after opening and using lipstick and glitter base. And you guys can see a, a live actual uh, tutorial. Go on her website at loveyshantae.weebly.com. And of course, if you guys like either one of these lipsticks that I'm showing you guys, I will have the exact links in the fashion box below. So yeah, I'm going to have a clip somewhere in this video showing you guys each lippy, except the one that I have on because I have it on. So I mean, I don't have to swatch that. So yeah, let's get off into okay. the swatches. So, we're going to go off into, since I already mentioned about I Am Powerful, the purple that I have on, we're going to go off into the I Am Breathtaking. And this is the navy blue. Honeys, oh my God, like this color is wonderful. Like it's that true, true deep navy blue. And I love her cosmetics, uh, her, her lippies, because they are so bright, bold, and vibrant for my honeys that love their lips to be popping love to be you know risk takers and have this a conversation piece yeah honeys this is it so yeah that is i am breathtaking we're gonna go off into sade or sadie and it is the fuchsia and then y'all know i had to throw a pink somewhere in the mix y'all know i'm a pink gal so i had to throw pink somewhere in the mix and I am in love with this color. Like, I can say, when I was applying it, it was a little bit messy. But again, like I previously mentioned in this video, anytime you're dealing with glitter, it's going to be messy. So, you should already know that. That's a given. But besides that, the pigmentation is crazy. Like, the overall staying power is bananas. Like, I am in love with this lippy. So, yeah, this is I am breathtaking. Next is... um. Victoria, which is the rose pink. And I know you guys are like, why you pick a rose pink? You guys know, I try to get lippies that I don't have in my collection. I'm tired of repeating the same colors. And this is a gorgeous rose pink or a rosy golden pink. And it is just gorgeous. Now, all of these that I did swatch on my lips, I did use a lip liner. Again, because I just like my lips to be popping and I wanted the color to be bold and vibrant. But again, you don't have to do this. This is just optional. Okay, so I do love that. Y'all see a clip somewhere in here? All right. Last but certainly not least is I Am Enchanting. And it's the iridescent color. And I know you guys are like, Lala. Why did you pick that white shade? That's giving me donuts, Krispy Kreme, ashy lip tees, ma'am. No, no, no. And I know I'm the first person to tell you guys I, I'm not feeling the white lips. But it's not really a white. You really can't see it on camera. But it's like an iridescent off-white. It's like a white, but it has um, iridescent uh, glitters in it. All different colors glitters in it. So I do like that. Um, it's just gorgeous. Now with this, I most definitely use a base. I use a white base from LA Colors on my lips because again, I want uh, my lips to be popping. I didn't want any you know, splotches or anything. So yeah, I really did like that. And as well as your items will be in this gorgeous leopard print baggie, which is phenomenal. Like when I opened the packaging, it smelled like baby powder. And I'm like, yes, it smells good. And it came with a letter telling uh, her customers about her her company and how she started and everything and I love that I mean I read it and it's just phenomenal like I, I commend you mama you doing the damn thing excuse my French um, I am loving what you're doing and of course I'm gonna get some, some of your items to put in my kit this is just phenomenal I'm in love so y'all please check her out again thank you so much for reaching out to me want me to do a review I love 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 your velvet glitter lipsticks they are amazing if you just want to do a neutral makeup look and you just want to put a little razzle dazzle on your lips this is it so yeah honeys i'll have all her social media networking sites in the fashion box below she is on instagram as well as ugh, if i can talk right honeys as well so i have all her social media networking sites in the fashion box below as well as mine i'm on instagram lala honey 06 and honey my contour my makeup artistry page honey my contour and you guys go on my facebook fan page and like it the real lala honey 06 mm-hmm yep bye honey